let's go ahead and go for the hair. This part of the hair is going to be darkest. Again, it's in shadow, okay? And use the side of your pencil to keep it a sketch, okay? We don't have to put a lot of detail in here. It's just shadow. Don't, don't go start trying to draw all kinds of hair. You don't want little hairs. That will look kind of funny on this. So just keep it very simple. And then you can bring the other hair down as well. But just fast. It's just a fast sketch in the hair. And if you want to leave a little bit more light, you can. But over here in the shadow, you know, where that shadow came over, we want to have that just a little bit darker, kind of wrapping around that head. And you can bring that hair down to, you know, be a little bit by the sideburns and I shaded that ear and you can put a little bit of shadow here at this side as well not a lot I just want to make it feel round the only thing other thing you could do is if you want to soften the edges a little bit you can here at the chin what I want you to be very careful of is not to leave a line where you're just drawing a line. Lines are made when shadows are bumping up to things, okay? So this needs to be a shadow. So what we could do is bring that shadow down a little bit farther to keep, so we have that line of the chin, and then go ahead and erase some of this line. And that's one reason I put a little bit of shadow on this side as well. Um, the second part of the nostril right in there. Okay, something like that. So now we have the nose placed right, and now we want to place the mouth. See where I would have placed the mouth? Maybe over here, when it's in fact over here. That's why you want to do this line, okay? So let's just kind of erase what I had there. And we're going to go ahead, and since it's a little girl, we can put a lot of, lot of definition in that lip. And, you know, bring that up, bring this little fold, exaggerate a little bit, and then bring it way down. And make it very, very full of curves. And remember those little muscles? I like to draw them because if I don't, I kind of forget how to draw this section sometimes. And I bring that down around that middle little muscle down. Then it kind of comes up again like that. And then it's going to come over here to the side of the mouth like that. Okay? And then our bottom lip, we're going to put right in here. And at this point, I'm going to go ahead and erase this middle line that I put on the face just to look at it, to see if we're on the right track. 